Damascus 1240, lanterns glow over streets alive with scholars and soldiers. But in a quiet study, a young physician prepares to defy centuries of thought. His name, Ibn al-Nafis. Surgeons of his age swear by Galen, who taught that blood seeps through invisible holes in the heart. To doubt this is heresy, yet Ibn al-Nafis will not accept what eyes cannot see. Late into the night, he dissects animals, scalpels glinting, ink staining his hands, his notes filling page after page. Until revelation strikes. He writes the blood must pass from the right ventricle to the lungs, mix with air, then return to the left side. Centuries before Europeans, he mapped the pulmonary circulation with breathtaking clarity. His manuscripts lie hidden in dusty libraries, guarded by time, waiting to be rediscovered. But in that moment, Damascus had already leapt centuries ahead. Ibn al-Nafis later died in Cairo, leaving behind a truth that outlived empires, a discovery that shapes our modern practice of medicine. Follow for more forgotten stories of medicine's bravest.